the latest in the battle between a handful of contractors and the mayor's office. Today, those workers say it comes down to helping North Omaha grow. KMTV Action 3 News reporter Josh Egbert joins us live with the latest on this. Josh. Well, Jen, stimulating the economy, that's what a fight with the city of Omaha is all about for local contractors here in North Omaha. A week after challenging the city, though, a compromise could be on the table. We're not trying to do affirmative action. We're trying to do economic stimulus in this quadrant. Not satisfied. That's the word from North Omaha contractors today, and they once again spoke out about being shut out. We're in a situation whereby we're not generating any money and the monies that we do have is leaves the community in the first place. Larry Helms Sr., Vice President of the United Minority Contractors Association, says Mayor Gene Stothert's Diversity Action Organization plan does nothing to put contractors to work. What would help is a supporting action plan. We do have a plan, an alternative, that will help us get on board to do the things that we need to do in the community. It's called the Creating a Strong Urban Based Contracting Class in Omaha. It's a plan Preston Love says they can get behind. What's at stake is the wealth and the reduction of poverty in North Omaha. Love says the fight against the city is not about ethnic diversity. It's about poverty. We're trying to do is deal with poverty in the quadrant of the city that needs an economic stimulus. He says the billion dollar sewer separation project could put these contractors to work, thus bringing money into the community. But contractors like Helm Sr. say the city has made it impossible for them to work. The licensing process. It works against the contractors, and it wasn't anything that was thought of that involved North Omaha contractors. But that claim, the mayor says, is false. She says Omaha's small and emerging business program was created specifically for these contractors. But the contractors still have to go down to City Hall to sign up and get certified. Now, the, the plan that the contractors had developed is modeled after a uh, company that was hired by the city in 2010 to help grow that small and emerging uh, business program. But in a statement to KMTV Action 3 News this afternoon from the mayor's office, the mayor says that their work uh, isn't, wasn't getting uh, the results that they were expecting, nor was it uh, growing the small business uh, program that they had hoped or creating the more diverse jobs. That company, the contract that was not renewed, back in 2014. The mayor does go on to say, though, that uh, she does uh, want this type of work and it is imperative and that the city is working to help these small businesses grow. Reporting live in North Omaha, Josh Egbert, KMTV Action 3 News. The first